Well, good morning, good morning, good morning, family. How is everyone doing? It's Freedom Point Friday, and it's a beautiful day here on the East Coast. I'm telling you, the sun is shining just as bright. The snow is melting away a little bit, but there is excitement in the air with the Team Effort Network family. We have some great things coming up to fight. I'm telling you, Sam, I was so excited for us in 2015. I don't know what to do with myself. I can hardly sleep at night. Well, you have dialed into the Team Effort Lifestyle Call where you will hear things that will move you from fact to faith to action. The line is open. This is Pastor Denise McDowell, in case you didn't know, along with my business partner, One Star, Pastor Del Way. For a family, the line is open. Go right ahead and introduce yourself. Let us know where you're calling in from. Yeah, I'm, I'm calling in from uh, Maryland. Hi, Miss. Hi, Miss Stella. How are you? Fine, thank you. Great day here in Kent. Oh, yes, it is, Miss Stella. Yes, it is. <laughs> and who is that joining us from Maryland? Uh, Pastor Dale from uh, Maryland. Pastor Dale, we were all looking forward to meeting you last night. You can't do us like that. <laughs> Pastor Dale? Did you yes, hear me? Yes. Yes. What we were looking about? forward. We were looking forward to meeting you last night. And I know. I know. I I, I was uh, I wasn't able to make it, but I'm I'm, I'm positioning so I can be there going forward. The rest That's assured. What about now? I understand you're going to be at the event tomorrow. Is that correct? Tomorrow. Yes, at the Greenbelt Marriott. That's that's my intention. Absolutely. Well, we're looking forward to meeting you, sir. Okay. I'm excited about but, that. And we are too. But keep it coming, family. This is with us. Go right ahead and DC in the house. DC in the house. DC in the house. All right. Mr. Robert Smith, how are you, sir? Oh, I'm pretty fantastic. Feeling great. Ready to roll. Looking great, Robert. Looking great. You ready for Vegas? You ready for Vegas? Ready for Vegas, baby. Ready for Vegas. Let's go. <laughs> roll the dice, let's roll. <laughs> Ooh, let's go. Keep it yep. coming, family. Who's with us this morning? Go right ahead. Yes, Jesse Bowden. Mr. Jesse Bowden called it for work, I oh, just said. Yes, I am. <laughs> We're getting it in, oh, though, Jesse, Pastor Newton. Jesse, you're called Dial back in, man. We hear you. Okay. So keep it coming, family. This is a team effort lifestyle call. Go right ahead. Introduce yourself. Where are you calling in from? Lloyd Gibson, Oklahoma. Hello, family. You guys still there? We are here, Pastor Denise. We're here. What, did the whole call drop or am I somehow? That was. We're here. No. Don Joseph, in Reveal, California. Are you there? We are here, yes, we're here. We are here. <laughs> I stop with everybody's call drop. No, you just dropped Pastor D. Oh, well, oh, I'm sorry. I can see I done blew it up over here, guys. I didn't touch a thing. Oh, I didn't touch a thing. Y'all blew it up over here. Outstanding, Pastor. He's definitely looking forward to the Super Saturday tomorrow. Can't wait. Can't wait. Early bird gets the biscuit. Don't forget. <laughs> Don Joseph, in Reveal, California. Hello, Don Joseph. How are you, sir? I am doing wonderful. Ready to go. Ready to go. Vegas, I, I will know. be there. I know that's why. Right. Look, I don't know if y'all are aware, but do you know Don Joseph? There's a call on Sunday evening, so if you have prospects on Sunday evening, if you want to hear about Team Effort Network, he has a call, 8 o'clock p.m. Pacific time, the same number, on Sunday evening. Of course, on the East Coast, that's 11 o'clock, but that's still good, a good way in the day. 
So make sure you just know that on Wednesday evenings and Sunday evenings, 8 o'clock in Pacific, John Joseph and the we are West Coast team do host the call at this number. Thank you, Pastor. The conference is now in presentation mode. Your line is muted. So welcome, John Joseph, and thank you for your leadership, you and Lord Gibson and Renetta Hall and all the great leaders throughout 10. We guys are doing a fantastic job keeping everyone informed, updated, inspired, and encouraged. All the TTPs taking place throughout the book for you and your guests to come. You know, take advantage of everything that's being offered to you. These calls are amazing. I listen in on Don's call, and I'm telling you, man, he is so passionate when he's going through the compensation plan, when he's going through the products, and everyone that's on the call just sharing their stories and their testimonies. You just want to always have someone plugged in so they can hear what you are a part of. This movement that has taken place in 2015 is incredible. And let me tell you something, family. I saw such a wonderful manifestation of love last night at our TTP. We got together afterwards, um, after we had the TTP, and most of the guests that left, we sat down, Pastor Dale, Maureen Smith, Anthony, uh, Jesse Bowden, Robert, Paul Jackson, oh gosh, who else was there? Um, uh, uh, Scott Dickens, Ray, Ray Wright, L.A. Anderson. We just stood around and we were talking about the big event that's coming up, the Ten Extravaganza, and we asked everyone, is everyone going to the Ten Extravaganza? And everyone, a couple of people said, well, I'm trying to get there, you know, I just, you know, don't know if I'm going to be able to have enough of a plane ticket, not sure if I'm going to be able to get a room, and guess what? Everyone says, well, look, you get, I'll help you with your plane ticket. Somebody else says, well, I'll help you with your room. Somebody else says, well, I'll buy you a ticket to get these set. It was just such a beautiful thing to see. Everybody, we want everyone to be there at this kid extravaganza. So everyone chipped in to make sure everyone that was there, that wanted to be there, someone took responsibility to make sure they made a way for whoever couldn't be there that they could get at that event. If it was a plane ticket they needed, then we, we helped them to arrange to get a good price on train ticket. If it was hotel, we arranged to get them in a room where they can share with someone. If it was food, that's taken care of. If it's getting an event, it's taking care of family. So get your team together. Ask them who really wants to be at this 10th extravaganza and do what you can, do what you and your team can to help them to get there. Because I'm telling you, it's an investment in their life and their future, and it's an investment in your life and your future. Everyone that's a part of this needs to be on March the 14th at the 10 extravaganza. You don't want to miss it. Let me bring on my business partner, uh, DCQ Qualified Executive Funding Member, uh, one star, Pastor Joe Wave. Are you there, sir? I'm here. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Wasn't that a great manifestation of love last night? Just making sure everybody, you know, had no excuse for not getting there, but everybody just kind of chipped in to try to help in whatever way they could, including you. Well, like that. <laughs> well, you know, <laughs> the goal is to get everybody there that we can get there. And if we can, you know, if we can find out why somebody is not going, especially if it's just a financial reason, uh, then, you know, we can all chip in. You know, uh, you know, like I said, I, you know, I would buy a ticket to, to, to the event. Uh, you know, we make sure that he had a hotel room. And then he can just focus on just getting his plane ticket instead of having to come up with all the money to get there. And that's exactly what we did. And he was like, well, you know, I'm not going to, I'm not going to, to, to Vegas. And he was like, well, why are you not going to Vegas? He's like, well, money. Well, you know, what's the problem? How much money you need? And once we started identifying what the problem was, then we were able to just to what give the solution. And uh, so he's coming to the to the to, to Las Vegas as a result of it. And uh, and that's what you guys have to do with your with your team, you know. Uh, there's going to be so many rooms, so many empty couches, so many places where people can crash. You know, let's take the, the 300 to $400 off their plate and, uh, and let's just have, have them focus on the airline ticket and we can give them everything else. So that's one of the things that we just want to really focus on. This is going to be such an event. It's going to be a huge event. It's going to be a, too, too much of an important event for anyone to miss. And so whatever we can do, you know, let's help everyone be successful and get there. So uh, we're really excited about it. You know, we had a great TTP last night, had a lot of guests, uh, people filling out those applications. That's another great opportunity uh, going into our 28th uh, this weekend. 
uh, again, at the Greenbelt Marriott, it's going to be really, really spectacular. So do whatever you can to get people to that um, March 14th event. It's going to be life-changing, and it's not your team is not going to be the same. So uh, that's what we're about. Did I hear there's another pastor, Dale? My goodness, we're going to get people confused here. <laughs> <laughs> there is another pastor, Dale, in the house. <laughs> Wow. Oh, yes, there is. Um, matter of fact, he just joined with Sandy Bowen's team, and uh, we were, we know that we were kind of looking forward to meeting him last night at the TPC. But you know how packed, but sometimes they, you know, you kind of can't get away. But apparently, he's going to try to make the events tomorrow. Pastor Dale, so you can meet Pastor Dale. <laughs> and we are looking forward to that. Well, family, as always, you know, we have some of the most beautiful people here on Team Method Network with hearts of gold. And I have two on the phone today, a husband and wife team, and I must honestly say they have hearts of gold, just loving, just passionate, just giving, sharing. And I love to hear their stories, love to hear their testimonies. I just love to hear when these two come together and talk about their excitement and their passion for Team Method Network. Great leaders in the company. I want us to welcome to the call Mr. and Mrs. Michael and Linda McLean. Are you there? Good morning. Good morning, Pastor Denise, Pastor Dale, and I am here on the call. Well, Michael, it is such a joy to have you on the call. I know you are one busy camper, and you had a big, a lot of great things on your plate, But uh, and I know everything worked out in your honor, so it is just a joy to have you back on the call. Um, is Linda here with you? I believe so. I think my lovely wife is on the call. She should be joining us shortly. Okay, Linda, Linda. There? Yeah. okay so what I'm going to do, Michael, while you're sharing, I'm going to reach out to make sure she doesn't have any problems getting on the speakerphone. But, Michael, we just please go ahead and introduce yourself to the family and just share your testimony about 10. You know, you know, you, and when I think about you, I think about those beautiful horses that you have and the story that you told when you were out there one day uh, with your horse's feet, and then you looked up, and there your horse was looking down on you, uh, which is part of your testimony. We just go ahead and share who you are and your story in regards to 10 vitamin praise. Yes, I would love to, Pastor Denise. I am so excited about 10 uh, and what is doing in my life as far as changing my health as well as my wealth in 15. Uh it's it's just it's, I'm just excited. I'm, I'm excited about what's getting ready to happen this coming Saturday. Of course, I won't be able to make it. I got another business uh, obligation uh, that I have to take care of out of town. But my wife plans to be there. Uh, but you know, it, it, I'm just thankful for the, the the team leadership that we have, and and yourself, and and Pastor Pastor Dale, and and of course our sponsor Maureen, and, and, and our. Uh, other team members, you, you know, we, we just have so many uh, uh, great people uh, in this family working together. Uh, you know, my, my testimony is, as you know, uh, uh, in 2010, I had a massive heart attack. And uh, for a long time, I, I before I had that massive heart attack, I, I thought I was, I thought I had the bill of health, clean bill of health. And, and I was doing everything uh, uh, under the sun, from working, uh, all different type of businesses, uh, just trying to uh, uh, make sure that, that, that my family had a, had a quality of life. And, and what I forgot about was my life when it came down to my physical health. And what I found out since being a 10, that uh, you can have all the wealth you want, but if your health is not together, uh, that wealth is not going to mean a, a bowl of beans. So uh, uh, since I've been in 10, I've been concentrating on my health. And I'm telling you, using these sprays from the D to the Super 10, the Slim by 10, uh, uh, to the Cell Energy, it's just been amazing, uh, the transformation that, that has taken place with my health. Uh, I, I remember when Pastor Dale, I never forget Pastor Dale asked me what my, D level was, and I told him I didn't know. And immediately, uh, when I got back home that, 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 that following day, I called my doctor and told him I need to come in and get my labs done, and I wanted to get my level done. So when I got my level done, I found out my D was 15. And that just blew my mind. 
And then once I found out that my D level should have been between 30 to 100 and the middle range is 50, I was a 15. And that, like I said, that just, my jaw dropped. And I had to ask my doctor, I said, you know, you've been my doctor for 15 years, but you never once asked me about uh, my D level. And it's just amazing, you know. And, and he said, well, you know, Mr. McLean, I'm not a nutritionist. You know, I, I'm about uh, 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 prescribing drugs to take care of any problems that you may have. You know, so I told him what I wanted to do is is I wanted to, to try something else. And he prescribed me 1,000 milligrams of vitamin D, 1,000 milligrams of vitamin D. And within a week's time, the, them two medications, they completely tore my stomach up. So I had to stop taking them. So I went back uh, and started using the spray, uh, vitamin D. And uh, before I knew it, within a six-month time, my, my, my vitamin D level went from a 15 to a 30. And that just, that just right there just told me that these sprays are working. Uh, so, you know, it's, it's just amazing. But, you know, uh, it's important that, that, that we uh, have to take care of our health. If, if we want to enjoy the wealth that, that we will be able to have uh, if we continue to work diligently and, and hard in, in, in all aspects of our finances, uh, we can have that. We can enjoy. You know, it's amazing uh, that I got more more time behind me do, do, than I do in front of me, and that kind of blew my mind also because I'm 61, be 62 in June. Now, do I have another 50 years? Hey, you never know. Now that I'm using these frames, you know, you never know. That's the that's the excitement part about living the day. It, it's just amazing what these frames are doing. I, I went to the doctor and, and, and uh, to the eye doctor, and my, they found some glaucoma. Uh, and since I've been using the cell energy, I went back uh, a year later and had another appointment done, had another uh, uh, procedure done. And come to find out, the glaucoma that they talked about, I, that they had saw, had disappeared. Wow. And that kind of, yes, that kind of told me that the cell energy also was working. So these products are truly working in my life, you know. Uh, and But, you know, the most important thing about skin, I tell you, it is bringing me and my wife closer from a business perspective. Uh, working together, working this business, we are excited about what we're doing. You know, I really want to tell her story, but I know she's probably on the line there. Her testimony about how she's using the sprays and how she's using the sprays with other family members. So she's on the line. Let me let me see and speak out to her. Linda, are you on the line? Yes, I am. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Tin family. Pastor Dale, Pastor Denise. Hi, husband. Hello. Good morning. <laughs> well, good morning, I just want to Linda. tell you guys about a. I have a secret testimony. I know you never heard of something like that, Pastor Dale and Pastor Denise, but I have a secret testimony. Um, it's in reference to my mother. She turned 85 uh, January 6th of this year. And um, I've been taking care of her for the last three months. She's had some problems in her home, a uh, silent killer called mold. And we found out that the mold in her home, she never, I mean, you would go into her home and it's spotless. You would never know it, see it, or smell it. But we found out my mother kept getting ill. And it makes me think of Pastor Denise. She kept getting, um, she had COPD, she kept getting pneumonia, she had bronchitis, she had all of these breathing problems that I couldn't understand for someone that has been so healthy why she was getting sick. So I'm a, I am one of five daughters, and I am usually the one that's always trying to figure out a way of doing something. So I would go in her home every day, and I would tell her what I thought it was. Well, we ended up paying about $900 for an air quality inspector to come into her home and measure her air. And we came to find out my mother was literally dying of mold poisoning. Wow. She had mold in her basement. Her home is about 60 years old. And I can tell you guys that mold grows and feeds on wood. And she has wood paneling in her basement. 
And behind those walls, we had no idea that her foundation was cracked and leaking. So for years, my mother's home had been literally killing her, and she didn't know it. So we basically took her. I went in and got, got the inspection report. He, in turn, said, you need to get your mother out of here ASAP. This was on a Thursday, family. That Saturday, I had a crew in her home where they ripped out all of her wall-to-wall carpeting, all of her basement ceiling, paneling, drywall, everything out of her basement, and I removed my mother out of the home. I would tell you in a week's time, she, she was just coughing and hacking and coughing and nose running. So I, and I mentioned our vitamins again to her, and my mother is very skeptical, and she was like, no, she didn't, she didn't want to take them. Okay, family, I have to confess my secret. I have been spiking my mother's orange juice every day (laughs) with the vitamins. And I am here to tell you, it's almost bringing me to tears. My mother is 100% better. She was 100% better within that week. But I couldn't tell her what I was doing because I was so, I, I was just so overdone with the fact that they were working and I could see them working in her that I didn't have the heart to tell her yet. So months have gone past. And she, she was also taking um, vitamin D and a pill. She ran out of her pills, and my mother came to me. I have gone, you know, come, come with her with 10, telling her about our products since we started, and she didn't want to hear anything. She came to me and said, you still have some of that vitamin D? And I said, wow. yes, I do. So I actually gave her a tube. I still haven't told her I've been spiking her orange juice every day. But I want you to know now, at 85, my mother is completely well. She has no breathing problems. She's not on any medicine. I have three sets of stairs in my home. My mother goes up and down these steps at least 15 to 20 times a day at 85. She feels no arthritis. She is completely well. In fact, she is so well that she got in her, she still drives. She has a Jeep Cherokee, and her and my other two sisters, they drove to North Carolina 622 miles last week, and she is fine. Wow. I, my husband and I are just totally overjoyed. I, I just don't think I can just quite tell her that I've been spiking her orange juice, but I'm here today to tell you not only have I put in the D, the B, and the cell energy in her orange juice, her tea at night. Um, she's drinking. I mean, I have nursed my mother back to health. And this is my secret testimony that she has no idea that I'm telling, but I have got to share this with everyone, that I have my mother back, and she's well. And at 85, she's probably as strong, her mind, you know, her eyes, I'm looking at her, and my husband can testify, you know, he has his mother-in-law back, I have my mother back, and she's well. And I know that by God's gift with 10 vitamins, this is, this is what we did. We, we, we made her well again, and she's completely well. She went back to her doctor, and I showed the doctor the, re- the mold report, which they took a copy of. But the doctor doesn't know all the other vitamins when she goes back, I think, in another week or so. But I will probably accompany her when she gets back from North Carolina. But again, family, <clears throat> this is I mean, this testimony that I'm telling you is just heartfelt because I saw the difference in my mother in three days. But I I just, you know, I kept saying, oh, no, you know, I'm saying to myself, I don't want to, I don't want to wish this because I know it. But I am telling you guys, my mother doesn't have an air purifier in her room. She hasn't breathed on any inhalers. She's not taking any steroids. She is completely well. And I just had to share that that testimony with you guys because, I mean, again, like I said, she still drives. She just drove 622 miles with with my sisters. And if she knew I was telling this testimony, I don't know what she would do. But I just have to tell it because it it brings joy to us to let you know that these products work and they're going to keep working. And not only do they work on me, you know, they're working on everybody else. And it's, it's just unbelievable. And I just had to share that with you guys. My God, when I tell you, that is... It's amazing. That That is amazing. And, you know, as you were sharing that, Linda, I was thinking, um, had you not known about the vitamin three, and if you had not heard uh, the testimony, um, you know, about uh, what's, how vitamin D 
can help with breathing problems and the coughing and the mucus and the shortness of breath. You know, and you you were, you said you were, you were watching your mother go through this respiratory condition, coughing and catching pneumonia and all those things, not knowing what it was. And and I'm right. thinking, like in most cases, people probably would have thought, well, maybe it's just you know old age. Maybe she's just getting you know tired, getting sick. But you yeah. knew that you had something that could help her with that. I you did. You know, and that. That is that that is what makes this story so amazing. Because you, I, I'm thinking about you know how someone else may not be aware of vitamin D, the importance right. of vitamin D, mm-hmm. how this phrase, and, and their mother or father, whoever, may be going through the same thing, and they could be just accepting the medication and the diagnosis that the doctor is giving them, and, and and you know planning for something different instead of planning to celebrate life. But you mm-hmm. knew, you knew that somebody else had those same symptoms and, and the vitamins, these 10 vitamin sprays help that. And you were determined not to let your mom, uh, you know, um, let that, you know, overtake your mom. And, yes. uh, and uh, that is just amazing story and amazing. It's, it's, it's just amazing, Pastor Denise, because I, I, you know, I questioned myself and I, I didn't feel as though I was doing anything wrong. I knew I was going to help her. But my mother is the type that if you tell her, you know, she's, she's mm-hmm. just going to think of a reason that it's not going to work. So I would spray, yeah. I would take, what I would do is I would give her a nine ounce paper cup of orange juice with her breakfast every morning. And I would spray the four pumps into that of B and four of D. I actually mix them. And I am telling you, I mean, I can't tell you how clean my house is because my mother has gone through my house. Like, I mean, I, I can't keep. She just won't keep still, and I can always tell, you know, I'm looking at her. She's outside washing windows in November and December. She's doing all kinds of things that she could not do, and my husband can actually, you know, testify to this. I mean, we've seen her actually reborn to 85, and I am telling you that she's a walking miracle, and probably by the time she gets back, I'm going to tell her, you know, all the other stuff that I put in there that she's been taking. But just the fact that she came to me and said, can I have some of that D? Now, she won't admit that the D is working. I know that because she hasn't. But I asked her every day, are you still taking your D? And she says, yeah, I'm taking it. But I'm looking at her going up and down these steps, not complaining. I mean, she's not on the pills that they gave her, all this stuff for arthritis. And I'm just, you know, it's just it's sitting back and looking at her. I just giggle to myself and I'm saying, oh, my gosh, you've been drinking that orange drink. Or I give her the Snapple tea with her dinner at night and put the Super 10 and, and the Cellar Energy. And it's just an amazing thing. And so you're right. You know, I, I knew that we had – I knew we had the miracle for her. She didn't know. But now I know that she's doing well. So I guess, you know, she's going to know eventually. But I couldn't wait to get on this call to tell you guys about my secret testimony with my mother and – you know, God is good all the time, but these vitamins are just unbelievable. They work. I know they work in me. They work in my husband, my children. But just to, to actually nurse someone back that was sick, I mean, so wow. sick to see how the, where they are today, it's just amazing, mm-hmm. and I love it. And, and Pastor you know, Reed, Pastor Reed, yeah. just to hear that, that testimony from my wife, uh, but to actually mm-hmm. witness it, to actually bear witness to her testimony uh, from my point of view. I mean, I've never seen that. This is the lady that was heading out the door back in 2010, uh, and she decided to turn around and come back out to give me a glass of water. And when she came back out, she she found me on the ground uh, when I was having that massive heart attack, Mm -hmm. along with my horses. And the bottom line, if it wasn't for her, uh, and I call her my angel because if it wasn't for the man of staff sending that angel to me that particular evening, I wouldn't be on this call today sharing this testimony of, of how the father had helped her, you know, because it was amazing. I mean, I would go there every day to take care of my horses and to see her in that house. And, and I didn't realize that houses got sick also, just like people. And yeah. her house, her house was sick. Her house was sick yeah. and was making her sick. And when my when my wife told me that we were bringing her to our house, I mean, I was 
so happy uh, uh, to be able to be able to be in a position to 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 help my mother uh, return back to, to to the help that she had because she was working around our house like a teenager at eighty five. I mean, I could not. Uh, I, I mean. I, when she left last week, I, you know, it was like, oh, I, I realized how much I missed her. I mean, I, every time I turned around, I mean, she must have worked that washing machine. I thought she was going to break the washing machine she was washing so many <laughs> But it, it, it's just, um, every time I turned around, she was mopping this, blacking and that. And I, I mean, at 85, at 85 years old. So that lets you know, you know, and, you know, and, and I'm looking at, you know, I'm looking at, and, I, and, and sometimes I have to be careful when I say, oh, because, you know, here I am, we'll be 62, and someday she has more energy than me, you know, so that's amazing what these products are doing, but I can't say enough that to anybody, uh, you can make all the money in the world. You can make all, and I have to say it again, you can make all the money in the world. But if you don't pay attention to your body and what it's telling you, because your body will tell you what you need. And I'm here to tell you, when I start using that spray, them sprays, from the D to the B to the cell to the super, uh, my body just craves for it. it just, and it lets me know if I miss a day. It lets me know if I miss a day. So I know these products are working. I'm I'm, I'm always testifying uh, with people about how they've changed my life, how they changed my wife's life, how they're working with my daughter. We sprayed my daughter. She swims competitively, and that's the reason why I can't come to the TDPs on Thursday because she swims on Thursday evening. Wow. And we we gave her some bees, and I don't know if that's still legal or not, but. <laughs> We sprayed, we sprayed her uh, some bee prior to one of her races, and she won all three races. <laughs> and it was like, oh, my goodness. And, then, you know, so now we're spraying her all the time. We're spraying her all the time with that bee boost. And I can just tell the energy that she's having. So, uh, and, and, and let me share this in closing. Uh, we had the pleasure of, of, of going to Vegas when they did the launch last year yes. and to, and uh -huh. to see the excitement. And this is for those who've never been out to Vegas, uh, within this process with 10, I'm telling you, you have to go to experience it for yourself. It was amazing to be there with Mel and Amy, to be there with, with, with memo and, and to be there, uh, with all the other people, uh, just to see the excitement in the room uh, and seeing people walk across the stage, getting their keys to their cars, uh, it, it was just amazing. So uh, if you haven't been, please, whatever you do, please try to make that trip uh, in March because, believe me, it will change your whole perspective on what these products will do and what this business will do for you financially. And, and, and in closing, if you put a whole lot in it, you get a whole lot out. If you put a little bit in it, you get a little bit out. If you put nothing in it, you get nothing out of it. And, and like my mother told me, that if you visualize it, prioritize it, and actualize it, it will change your life. Thank you, Pastor Denise. Oh my God. Michael and Linda, you know, family, I don't know if you all really uh, uh, caught what Michael said earlier. Um, Michael had um, a heart attack in 2010. He was outside um, feeding his horses and, and uh, had a heart, a massive heart attack. And what he's saying that his mother, his mother, Linda's mother, they were leaving the house. She just so happened to come back in to go out to check with Michael to see if he needed some water. And she's the one who found him there, laying down. Uh, after having a massive heart attack. So if it wasn't for her coming back, That's right. then we don't know what the story would have been. But now, here we are, a year or so later, here Michael's mother-in-law was in a condition where she was losing her life. That's right. And now, because of the, you know, the 10 vitamin sprays, now she was able to regain her health as well. 
I tell you, boy, God got a way of doing some amazing things. Yes, some does. amazing things. This is an incredible story. And family, I'm going to tell you, if your mother is still living, because my mom is not here. I lost my mom when I was 10 years old. If your mom and your dad are still here and they live in a house that's 50 or 60 years old and you haven't had an air quality check or they're yes. coughing or they're losing weight or they don't have energy, it's not that they're getting old. As you can yes. see, this woman is 80, 85 years young. And she's right. cleaning the house and mopping the floors and washing windows. Good yeah. Lord in heaven. You know, so don't just think mom and dad's getting old. You have these vitamin sprays. You need to give mom and dad on these vitamin sprays to keep them healthy. So they can live a, what, what Psalm 91 says, a great long life. A long life will I satisfy thee, is what we promised, long life. What an amazing story. Pastor Dale. I'm going to bring you in before I lose it right about here, because this is one amazing story. Pastor Joe, are you there? Pastor Joe, if you're there on mute. Maybe he's not there. Okay, I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I was on mute talking. <laughs> that is an amazing, amazing story. Uh, they are wonderful. I mean... Mike and Linda, you know, you guys, it's just a blessing to hear uh, the testimony. And now to hear the secret testimony about your mom. That is awesome, awesome, awesome. And, uh, you know, when you think about what they've just shared, guys, you know, this product is changing people's lives such, to such a degree that she says, well, you know what, I know this will help my mom. I'm going to just give it to her and let not, <laughs> she not even know about it. And look at the result, man. Yes. She's feeling better. She's going up and down the stairs. She's breathing better. Yes. That just goes to show you that, as Mike said, if you give yourself to this business, it will pay you. It will it will give you the return. And as it, there's nothing like having your health. It doesn't matter how much money you have. If you don't have your health, I'm telling you, it is not something, the place that you want to be in. I thank you guys for being on this call. You guys are always an inspiration to us. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, Pastor Dale. Thank you. Wow. Well, you know, Mike and Linda, we're coming to that big old mansion this summer. We're bringing a whole team, and we're jumping in that pool, and we're going to have a cookout, and we're going to ride horses. We're coming this summer, so get ready for us. <laughs> we're getting ready. Yeah, well, we, 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 we're truly putting that already. We talk about it all the time, about bringing our kids' family to just enjoy the fruits from the hard labor. But once yeah. again... Pay attention to your health, family. Please pay attention to your health. Thank you once again, yeah. Pastor Denise. Pastor Denise. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What an amazing story. I'm so glad Terry Whitener records these calls because, my goodness, to be able to catch them and listen to them again and to share them with other people is priceless. And, Michael, I heard you say earlier that you were, you were dealing with glaucoma, that you had glaucoma and the vitamin sprays helped with that. Yes, yes. Like I said, I was totally shocked because of my type 2 diabetes. They found some issues going on behind the retina. And uh, just and that was like six months after, uh, six months ago when I was using the sprays prior to that. And, and then when Cell Energy came out, I started using that cell. And when I had my um, eye test done in November of 14, uh, the, the doctor looked at me and she said, you know, we don't detect any issues with that problem that you were having with the glaucoma that we saw. Uh, we saw some fluid behind your, behind your retina, and it, we, we, we contributed to the diabetes, but uh, there, there, there's an early sign of some glaucoma. Uh, but now we don't see it. We don't see it. And that just, when I saw it, when, when she said that, it just, it just brought me back to, once again, using these sprays. And I can't thank Maureen enough for bringing my wife into the business uh, and, and her signing up. And she used, started using the sprays, and then I started using them. And, and tr I'm telling you, family, um, physically, I feel 100% better. All my labs came back better. My doctor was saying, whatever you're doing, keep doing it. Uh, and, and I know for a fact that, that, and I cut my meds from 22 pills down to 11. Uh, 
and 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 and, and we are steadily removing the prescription bottles out of our cabinet. You know, so it's a ble- it's a blessing. It is a blessing. My God, wonderful, 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 wonderful testimony. I can't wait for Mel and Amy to hear this one. I'm telling you, this is incredible. Linda and Mike, thank you so very much. We love you guys. Love and, you guys. I uh, look too. forward to seeing you. Love you so much. Look forward to seeing you really soon. Wow. Well, so let's go out to the UK. I need a pool, Dr. Need a pool. But that quote as we go into the weekend. Dr. Pool, was that amazing or what? Absolutely, Denise. I presume you can hear me okay? Yes, I can. How are you? I am good, thank you. I am good. And my goodness me, what amazing testimonials we've had today and the whole week. Absolutely incredible. Um, You know, I'm just so happy for you, Michael, with the diabetes and glaucoma, you know, for Linda and her family, for her mum. You know, these are really, really important issues that the TEN sprays have helped you know for example the the glaucoma glaucoma is associated with diabetes you know the more the diabetes goes out of control or less control the greater the chance of having glaucoma but also they're also both of them individually and together are often associated with low D3. There's a lot of uh, research out there that's showing that low D3, not in all cases, but in some cases, um, can contribute to both diabetes and glaucoma. So, for example, Michael getting his D3, and we know that his D3 was very low, getting his D3 level up with the TEN sprays, in particular the D-Power, that's had an incredible effect. Plus, the Super 10 and the cell energy, the antioxidants in those have helped as well because, you know, these are chronic inflammatory disorders. Diabetes is associated with inflammation, and inflammation is associated with toxins. So if you can mop up those toxins with antioxidants, which have an antitoxic um, effect, they mop up the free radicals, they mop up the toxins, you can have an anti-inflammatory effect. So, you know, these are absolutely great. And, of course, diabetes, you know, even the nerves get affected and the neuromuscular system gets affected with diabetes. So that's where the B-boost comes in as helping with that as well. And, obviously, anything that affects your eyes, your eyes are one of the most important um, sensory elements and part of your senses is your nerves. So the B vitamins are incredibly, incredibly important. So, you know, it, it's so fantastic to hear a history of going from glaucoma to almost nil glaucoma now and diabetes under control. So that's absolutely fantastic. And uh, Linda's mother's story, and, and I'm so glad that, uh, you know, you did spike her, her orange juice and her, her nighttime drink, et cetera, Linda, because, you know, that's obviously helped her, obviously removing her from that moldy um, uh, basement and, and house has obviously helped as well. But um, the, the things that Linda were describing that happened to her mum are characteristic things that happen with too much mold. You know, mold tends to grow in, in damp areas or dusty areas or wood wood is very difficult to actually dry out and even more difficult to dry out in a basement. A basement gets very uh, little sunshine. It has less aeration. And so it's a characteristic place to, for mold to grow. And mold can affect every single system. If you're constantly breathing in mold, it's going to affect obviously your respiratory system, but then it's going to um, affect other systems because it's going to put them under strain like the immune system, um, you know, your blood system. It can even affect the liver, the kidneys. It can even affect your eyes because literally that mold, it's called mycotoxins, those toxins that are in the mold are in the air all the time. So they're going on your skin, you're breathing them, um, they're, they're, they're going on your eyes. So they can affect absolutely nearly every system, basically. And even more dangerously, because they put the body under so much strain, they, put, they, they cause 
chronic inflammation all of the time and they put the immune system under even more pressure. So then it becomes a vicious cycle for the body to try and fight them, basically. And it can even, in some cases, you know, it, it's so good that Linda uh, removed her mother and, and got that $900 air quality inspector report done, basically, and removed her from there and got her onto the TEN sprays. Because in some cases, some moles and some mycotoxins can even cause cancer and even damage the nerves. You know, it's that dangerous, basically. And obviously, anyone who's older, their immune system is, is, is less anyway. Their antioxidant level is less anyway. You know, as we grow older, our antioxidants are, are, are going down, as it were. So... Actually, topping up our antioxidants with the glutathione, uh, for example, the most powerful antioxidants in the body, glutathione that's in our cell energy, plus it has other antioxidants in it, and the antioxidants in the superden, plus it has the ionic minerals. So basically what Linda has done is she's been able to top up the antioxidant level, top up the ionic mineral level, and top up the vitamin levels, in particular the D3, B12, B6, B3, for her mother, inadvertently. <laughs> um, and obviously her mother's system has benefited from it. Her immune system, it's helped to fight the inflammation, and it's helped to actually improve all the systems in her body. So um, it's exactly as, you, uh, you know, you say, Denise, as well. Actually, you know, over 80, that's not elderly, really. You know, she's a young over 80. It's just her system was put under strain by these mm -hmm. toxins from the mold, basically. Mm -hmm. And, you know, they say... Don't consider elderly people as old. In fact, mm -hmm. they've done some research that shows that the over 60s, they're not necessarily getting unhealthy. If you can compare them to the, a younger generation, often the illnesses are increasing in the younger generation. It's just that we have an aging population, so we have a greater population. But, you know, that generation over 60 and over 80, they actually often, if it wasn't for the fact that money was less in that age and people went through the depression and wars and all sorts of things that obviously affected nutrition and it affected income and a standard of living, but even though the younger may have a higher standard of living comparatively than the over 60s and over 80s when they were at that age, the reality is they're eating more poorly in terms of their nutritional intake. That is the young compared to the elderly because the habits of the elderly were actually better. They cooked each day. They ate simple, they didn't eat processed food, they often grew their own uh, vegetables and fruit, etc. They didn't eat too much meat, too much dairy, but they ate a bit of everything. It was a very balanced diet, and they've kept that routine up, even into their old age. And so we need to look at the habits of the elderly to get some tips, really. It's not from the youngsters, you know. So, in, in fact, I even saw an ad that a, a bank is um, actually creating a, uh, a recruitment drive of the over 50s. Now, obviously, some of this is just marketing ploy, basically, but some of it is because the older people often have common sense, good routine, good habits, they take responsibility, and they have a lot of life experience. So, you know, all that life experience and all that energy of Linda's mum, Linda has been able to save that by getting to the grips of what Linda's uh, mum's respiratory problems were, where it was coming from, remove her from those toxic places, and actually get her onto the TEN sprays. So that's absolutely marvelous. 
And had she lived in the UK, I am telling you folks, the UK is in a mess health-wise. And I'll give you more statistics next week on what's happening with the NHS, but it is frightening. And it, recently I saw a headline, elderly just get five minutes of care. Now, these are people who don't have, um, you know, sons and daughters around. They, they live on their own. They have no family to look after them. Uh, the council have to send somebody in, uh, their pensioners. They have to send somebody in uh, to help look after them. But because the UK is so strapped for cash, the NHS, the councils, etc., contracts are being drawn up where these people are only getting five minutes of care by the caregivers. Five minutes is only enough to make a hot drink, basically, let alone help them dress or help them bath or help them get out of bed, etc. So, you know, it's really, really important worldwide, folks, and it's not just the UK that's in a, a problem health-wise. Uh, the whole of Asia is having problems. The whole of uh, the USA is having problems. The difference in Asia, obviously, is families tend to look after their elderly. So we've got to get back to that. We've got to look after our elderly, just like Linda uh, has with her parents. And we've got to really seriously look at health and preserving our nutrition and preserving our health. So, you know, William Blake said, the thankful receiver bears a plentiful harvest. That's exactly what Michael and Linda have done. They are so thankful and grateful for these wonderful TEN sprays and the fantastic opportunity They've borne a very plentiful harvest. You know, it's absolutely great to have you all in the team. It's great to have Maureen in the team. What an amazing testimonial yesterday from Maureen. What fantastic testimonials all week. And obviously, what Linda's done, is she's borne a plentiful harvest with her family as well because she's been able to help her mum and she's been able to help her family. So this is absolutely wonderful. Mark Twain said, whenever you find yourself on the side of the majority, it's actually time to pause and reflect. We're in the minority, folks. Nobody hardly knows about these TEN sprays, just the current representatives. And we're only really just getting going now. Now's the time to really go out there big time so that we then become the majority. But you know what? Once we're the majority using the TEN sprays, Mel and Amy have so much vision, they'll already have worked out what the third division is going to be. So can you imagine we're going to be earning on my video talk and TEN and the third division, the fourth division, and wherever Mel and Amy take this. And if they're going to take it really, really big, folks. So Jim Rohn said, if you don't design your own life, Chances are you'll fall into someone else's plan. And guess what they have planned for you? Not much. Folks, you don't want to be in the hands of employers and corporates. You want to be in the hands of Mel and Amy because they've got planned for you a hell of a lot. You just have to go out there, use the TEN sprays, use the My Video Talk tools, and go out and share the opportunity. It's as big as that. Back to you, Denise. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Poole. Now, like you said that, you know, uh, like most of the people don't know about Tina. You know, I said that if you don't know, you better ask somebody because the world is really going to know about Chen 2015 because the stories like this with Michael and Linda's testimony, it's really good at getting out about this product. People are going to be knocking out doors down so want to be a part of what we're doing. This is literally changing people's lives around the globe, which is what Mel and Amy's vision was, to change people's lives. That is our number one product. Our number one product is changing people's lives. So, family, what an incredible story. Pastor, do you have any closing remarks before we end for the weekend? Well, I tell you, you know, uh, that was a great presentation done by Dr. Nita Poole. And, uh, you know, you guys, these are why, this is why these calls are so important, uh, because you really want to get people on these calls so that they can hear these testimonies. When you hear testimonies like Mike and Linda McLean, uh, you know, everybody 
know somebody that has challenges in their family like they do. And they made a decision to make sure that their family is on this product, and as a result, they're getting the benefits. So you want to definitely do that. And don't forget, uh, tomorrow is going to be an amazing uh, time at the Greenbelt Marriott at 11 o'clock. Get there. Don't come along. Bring your guests. It's going to be powerful. The Green Belt Marriott, tomorrow, family, is where you want to be. And, uh, you know, I also want to mention, if you're on the East Coast, wherever you are, if you're trying to uh, get a plane ticket to uh, be at the Ten Extravaganza, uh, Maury Smith is really, really very good at really finding uh, good air prices. She will do the research for you. I'm not saying she's going to pay for your ticket, but she will do the research and help you to find a really good plane ticket uh, to Las Vegas. So if you... If that's your holdup, you know, reach out to me. I'll give you her contact information, and she'll just do some research for you. Make sure you get a really good price and get in into Las Vegas because Ted Extravaganza is just a couple of weeks away, and we want everyone to be there. Mom and Miguel has planned some extraordinary things, extraordinary things for this event. You do not want to miss it. Well, thank you once again for being today, and keep before you the one-year Power of Two Challenge. The One Year Power to Health and Wealth Challenge. Get your two. If you if you already have two new people in January, you're in the race. If those two people have their two in the month of February, you are in the race. If you don't have your two for January, February, get them in March. Remember, this one year starts at the month that you start. But congratulations for those who are in the race, who completed January, who completed February, and who's already started on March. This challenge is going to get you at $22,750 residual every month starting January 2016, family. It's in front of you. This year is going fast. It's going to be here and gone before you realize it. And you're going to be happy that you stayed in the race. Stay in the race. Keep your head up. Keep going. Don't you quit. Don't you do it. If you're quitting here on now, you're going to dislike yourself for a very long time. So let's go full steam ahead with Team Up and Network. Melanie McGill, we love you and we thank you for allowing God to use you, to use the help of the ordinary person live an extraordinary life of financial freedom and abundance. Family, God bless you all. Go out there and make a difference in this day. Share, share, share. I'll be back with us Monday morning to hear more great things about what's happening here in Team Efforts Network. You are loved and you are appreciated. God bless you all and have a prosperous weekend on purpose. Mwah.